want you to think about this here. In your entire lifetime, how much money has gone through your hands? How much? Let me explain to you what I mean by this. Maybe you made $73,000 last year at 28 years old. And the first time you got a check was 14 years old, it was $100. Add that whole thing up. You'll come out with a number, $493,000 or $1.9 million or $6.3 million, depending on who it is watching this video. The question is this, how much is left in your wallet? Truly, what is in your wallet? Not what's in your wallet with capital choice. I'm talking like really, what's in your wallet? What do you have left? How much savings do you have left? And if you're not too happy with this question, it's very simple. The reason why you don't have a lot of money left is because you don't know how to play the money game. Simple as that. So today in this video, I'm gonna cover with you 20 rules of money. These are rules of money that I've followed and it's obviously from a lot of mistakes I made because there was a point in my life where I had made money, there was nothing left in my pocket. So I'm telling you from experiences. But rule number one is the most important one. And it's the one you have to buy into immediately. It's very simple. You can fight it, say whatever you wanna to do to it. It's a rule. And the rule is, it's a game. Money is a game. And the great thing about any game is the following thing. No matter what game you play, the most eventually get good at it. If I've never played chess and I play you and you played 100 times chess, you're probably going to beat me. If I have played Monopoly a thousand times and you play three times, I'm probably going to beat you because it's a game. So the great thing about the money game is it can be learned. So many times people fight it. And they have problems with it. And they say, well, you know, it's, that person became rich because they're smart. This person did this. No, no. They learn the game. And you can also take the time to learn the game. Rule number two is don't be a hater of money. If you hate money, you'll never get money. Because money doesn't like haters. So if you're a hater and you constantly say things like, well, money doesn't grow on trees. And money is this and money is that. And rich people are this. You're right. Money says, you're right. I'm not turned on by you. It's almost as if going on a date with an...